Hey folks, Lisa here from Call That Girl, giving you another quick Outlook tip of the day. Today I'm going to talk about removing this new feature from Microsoft called Clutter. Uh, I am not a fan of extra clutter in my inbox, which I believe this for me is going to be. I already have a nice management system of how I do my email. As you can see, I have a nicely uh, organized folder list here. And I'm not a fan of Microsoft deciding where it's going to put my email. So what I'm going to show you today is how to disable it and get it out of your Outlook. So here we get the email from Outlook. What is clutter? Stay on top of your email. Blah, 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 blah. We're going to disable it. So at the bottom, go to options. And what this does is it logs us into our Office 365 email. We're going to do that right now. And sign in. And then over here, we click on options. Over here, clutter. Again, in case I went too fast, little wrenches up here, options. Over here is the new clutter box. Here it says separate. Mm, yeah, over the past seven days, it's found 16 items as clutter, saving me 3.2 minutes, which that is not worth my time. So don't separate items right here. Hit save. Now, it won't do that feature anymore, separate my items, but in Outlook, unfortunately, you can see, you know, we have to close Outlook, file, exit, and open Outlook again, and it's probably still going to be there. <laughs> so, what I tend to do is uh, go up to clutter, and we're just going to delete that folder. Yes. Now we're back to, it's gone. <laughs> and it should not deorganize or organize or do anything with my email anymore. Uh, this is a new feature that Microsoft is sending out. To me, I believe it's really similar to the filters that Gmail puts in uh, and forces social promotions to be in one and other things at the, you know, at the top of your Gmail, which I'm not a fan of actually, but some people might be. And if you do like the clutter feature, great. If you need help with this, which I hope my video showed you how to do that, or if you have any other Microsoft Office issues, please give me an email at lisa at callthatgirl.biz. You can call me at 612-865-4475. I am for hire, so if you need me, let me know. If you like this video, share it, like it, and subscribe. Thank you.